YouTube, it's Selena. Come back at you with another video. Okay, in this video, I'm gonna I'm gonna try and do a braid. I just want one successful braid out. All my braids be looking ratchet and okay. So here's what I'm gonna do. This is my plan. Cause usually I use the same products for my twist out. I use the same products that for my braid out, and that obviously does not work. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna try to do a little something different. So because my hair is crazy dirty. Yes, I wore a puff today. I put some gel in it, and now I'm a uh, flaky McFlaky. So, I gotta handle that. What I'm gonna do, I'm gonna use my Shea Moisture, what I use all the time. Moisture Retention Shampoo. I'm gonna use my uh, Deep Treatment Mask. And then I'm gonna use the Scleral. I like using this because it detangles my hair. I'm pretty sure I've already praised this stuff. Ooh. I got another bottle just in case I run out because <laughs> I dye my hair so much. Okay, but here's the difference in the products I'm going to be using to actually do the braids. Um, I'm going to uh, use my Curl Enhancing Smoothie along with my uh, Goddess Curls Gel. And hopefully these two mixed together is going to give me that nice braid out. I hope. That's the plan. That's what I'm trying to accomplish. We gonna see if I can actually do this. Um, yeah, uh, pray for me. Just one one successful hairstyle. Hey YouTube, I'm back. Um, I can see I just ooh, okay. Water slinging everywhere. All right, I'm back. You can see I've just washed my hair, so it's drippy, drippy. Um, so right now I'm going to start putting my hair in sections for it to be easier to work with. Okay, so basically it's the same amount of sections I always have. Four in the top, three in the middle, two in the back. start on the sides and then I work my way elsewhere so see this will be one braid so this will be one braid and this will be another braid do not have my clips so I'm just gonna have to wing it all right so I'm just going to apply the curly panting smoothie Down the hair, make sure you get some on those ends. Or it's dripping all over me. Woo woo. So, there you go. I'm gonna take a little bit of my gel. Okay, so the only thing I have to mention now about my braiding process is um, once I have gotten, I guess there's not enough hair for me to continue the braid, I just do a twist for the rest of the braid. Um, nothing really special. That's what you see now would have been my process had I continued <laughs> with my braiding and not have, no gotten lazy hence the title so uh yeah thanks
say, you know what? Shoot. Screw this. Sorry, I got my shop out from doing right I don't do my house and right now it's gonna take forever in a day. So let's do wash again so much easier. Alright, now you know, I got way too lazy and decided to do a wash and go instead. So, yeah. Um, the only note that I have to make about my wash and go is that I did use a little bit too much product. You see, it's all white. Um, which is probably why my hair is so dirty now. But, hey, it looked good, you know, the first few days. So, there's a plus. I'm shaking it out. Mmm, shake it, girl. So, yeah, I literally just slapped that curl enhancing smoothing on and the gel and kept it moving. It took me like 20 minutes. That was it. It looks nice. This is how it looks wet. So that's my hair wet, and uh, I guess I'll see you guys when it's dry. I'll be like this. <laughs> so annoying. Got a natural hair. Peace. For now. Okay, thank you guys so much for watching my video. As you can see right here, these are three pictures of my hair when it's wet. Um looks so nice and long and then the next pictures you are going to see is when my hair has shrunken up completely as dry as the next day and yeah anything to say please comment down below and I'll see you in my next video bye